Yo, what's up everybody? It's Stephen here from Mod to Fame and we are here at the airport. Bro, we just made it to the gate. Almost missed our flight. I haven't missed a flight in years. But anyway, we head into Houston, Texas. Let's jump into it. Let's go. I'm in the zone. Give me the throne. One shot, that's all that you got. That's all that I know. Yo, I missed the gate agent. She was like, <laughs> I was like, how y'all doing? She was like, we good, getting ready to leave you. Cause we the last ones walking up the jet bridge right now though, man. We made it, <laughs> whether you're first or you're last. You made it, that's all that matters, so. All right, boys, let's, let's get here and get on this flight, boy. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Hey, man, y'all see the vibes, man. All right, let's get on to Houston. Boy, oh boy, I tell you, only your boy stuff. Only your boy stuff. Barely made it, but we did. You know, gotta, gotta do the exit roll, cause you gotta have that extra, that extra space for seating, you feel? Anyway, it's about to be a good trip, man. I'm already on the road with some birthday people. It's about to be, hey, birthdays, birthdays going across the road. They going to Houston to celebrate birthdays. Y'all know why we going to Houston, though. Hey. Good morning. My name is Robert. TX2K, hey, baby. All right, we on our way. We see y'all there. Run it to the top. Hit they ass with them jet moves. Never gonna stop. Show they ass with that fat joke. I'll be at the spot. Ducking low. Counting death smokes. Hit them with the jet. Hit them, hit them. Welcome to Texas. Welcome to Texas. Houston, we out here, boy. You know the vibes, man. I'm excited, man. I can't wait to touch down. Uh, today, we're going to probably just chill a little bit. And then tonight, we're going to see y'all outside. But uh, y'all want to chill for the day with us right now. Experience Houston a little bit from a car guy's perspective. All right, come on. So before you cared about was going fast. I don't care about the car, nothing else. What you mean you don't care about the car? What you mean? You know what I'm saying if I don't care about the brand of the car, whatever, mm -hmm. all I care about is if I had to buy a car and I just want to go fast and I got 30 grand, right? I'm getting a Mustang GT. Straight like that. 10 speed, yeah. Guess the Mustang guys will be happy to hear that, huh? Well, depends they, on how you look at they it. They know what they got. And they know why they got it. You saying? They know what they got and they know why they got it. The problem is they don't have the 30 grand. <laughs> 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 but they want to treat it like they car is a car that has 30 grand in it. You know what I'm saying? So they, yeah. they want to treat they I get it. 10 speed car that runs a 10 9, 10 8 on a glory pass like it's a Hellcat. It's not. Right. It's not that yet. You know what I'm saying? you saying they're running their car on the ragged edge of blowing it up to get to that number and hoping and praying it doesn't. They, 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 they they do the tag along thing. Okay. So, yes, everybody on Michael Jordan's team got a ring. But everybody on the team wasn't Jordan. <laughs> but they got a ring. So what they do is, you know, they walk around with that champion mentality. Right. But they don't put in the work of the champion of that team. So what they'll do is they'll pull up an Instagram page of somebody that's really, really fast. But that person put, they put the work in. They put the money in. You know what I'm saying? So they act like that's them. Or better yet, they act like, as we used to say back in the day, me too. Oh my yeah, you car. see us? They say us. Right. But what I do notice in the Hellcat community that's weird to me, the Hellcat community is weird in that they have like really fast cars, guys, but they act like they don't see it. You know what I'm saying? Or they don't champion it. They don't do like the Mustang guys. Mustang guys be like, look, my car is this fast because of this car. 
Hellcats be like, my car is that fast because it's my car. Meanwhile, they got six grand into it and want to compare their car to a car with 30 grand into it. It's like, it's not the same, bro. So the Hellcat guys Like, I got guys with upper pulley Hellcats that want to come, want to race me. I'm like. Now? Bro, they stay in the car. Uh, the upper, they got a. <laughs> now? Upper, they got an upper, lower, ported blower, and they want to race me. A 10 speed Mustang is $35,000. If you spend thirty five thousand dollars for one car, you in an RT. <laughs> you feel me? You got the swag, you got the look, you got the sound, but you don't have but the you speed. Can't compete. You don't have the raw speed of a ten so speed then, Mustang. Now you got to spend forty five thousand to fifty five to fifty thousand to get into a Scat, and the Scat is relatively close to a ten speed Mustang, but it's not. Like mm. you're gonna lose. Mm. It's just you can't you can't really. You can't really compete at that level. Well, boys, your favorite YouTuber has been busy, man. Left the airport, came to check into the house that I rented. Um, it's pretty dope. Um, and also picked up the car that we gonna be cruising in. And I'm about to show all of that to y'all right now in this quick little montage in three, two, one. Yeah, that's right, boys. Y'all see it, man. Y'all see the house. Y'all see how we live in. When you get used to a certain standard of living, bro, no matter where you go, you got to live like that. You know what I'm saying? And when you get used to driving a certain level of car, you got to drive a car like that. Y'all know the TikTok. Big Body Benz. Remember, I used to be dusty. <laughs> so we backed out the Big Body Benz, man. You know what I'm saying? Not quite Big Body. It's a Benz Coupe. Uh, E-Class Coupe E400. So y'all see what it is, man. And it's just something decent to ride around in while we out here because, you know, the Hellcat wasn't able to make it due to the fact that I broke it. Testing to come here. But I'm not going to let that stop my good time. So we're going to ride around, chill, all the windows down, cooped out, nice interior. Y'all know how it is. And we still going to bring out that action the whole time we out here in TX2K. And to give you the rundown on the house, yeah, it's a big boy. You know what I'm saying? Four bedrooms three bath laid out laid out y'all y'all saw it man y'all y'all see what it is we don't we don't do nothing but the best and like i said when you get used to having a certain lifestyle then you're just used to uh, accustomed to living that certain level of lifestyle so i don't show y'all a lot of this type of stuff but this is how i live period you know what i'm saying glory be to god thanks to god you know it's not nothing crazy to some people but to a lot of people, you know, this is where you usually stay in a hotel, whatever the case may be. I'm not used to living like that no more. So that is what it is. But guys, thank you for joining me on my trip to TX2K, the Houston area. The action videos start 
later this week we're gonna be dropping them one after the other it is not gonna stop can't stop won't stop rock it till you reach the top <laughs> it's happening it's your boy Stephen here from Monta fame if you like this video you know what to do like subscribe share hit that bell notification so you don't miss no more videos going forward big body Benz member I used to be dusty we out we out